A total hip replacement operation removes the damaged portions of the bone and replaces the diseased bone with parts that duplicate the ball and socket joint. The socket part of the hip joint is a cup-like cavity in your pelvis known as the acetabulum. During total hip surgery, this area is prepared and a metal shell which fits tightly into the bone is pressed into place. Sometimes we use screws to help secure the shell until bone can grow into the metal implant. Inside the shell, we fit a new bearing surface. The other half of total hip surgery involves the upper leg bone, known as the femur. The head of the femur is removed or reshaped during surgery. The center of the bone is shaped to receive the new implant.